Namaste soul buddies. So, uh, these are the messages from crossed over loved ones. It could be your pets, your parents, siblings, cousins, colleagues. Uh, maybe, uh, you know, I think I have uh, covered cousins, right? So, it could be your friends, your close friends. It could be anyone. See, as soon as you see any message on any of the cards, the first person which pops on your mind is the person like who's talking to you through these cards. So this is I feel healthy and happy. I see a male energy here. It could be your dad, brother, friend, husband, a male child whom you have lost in past 3 to 13 months. I'm hearing he loved adventures. He loved this, you know, free spirited energies. He hated when people tried to control him or dominate him. And I see that he always, uh, you know, he wanted to touch the stars. He always had these dreams to make it big in whatever field he was working. I'm hearing photography, painting, gardening and uh, some kind of hospital administration, I guess. So it was my time to go. So this person loved making footprints on the wet sand. He loved going to the sea beach and he loved slow conversations you know less talking he was a man of more actions and less of talking i i'm getting this is a man uh, i can see god's face here you can see this eyes nose so he's been protected he's been watched over by god now and he is at peace completely at peace and yes he misses this uh, community uh, sorry the uh, connection which he shared with you as a father as a son as a brother or as a friend and he's been missing the way you spend time with each other in nature under the sun. I wish I had told you more often how much I love you and you are never alone. So this could be male or a female energy. Here I felt very strongly these are the male energy cards, one and two. So third and fourth cards, it could be male or female. It doesn't matter. It could be a pet because I'm hearing that it could be a cat or a parrot or another bird. Love birds maybe. It could be your fish. I wish I had told you more often how much I love you. So this is like this person could not express, uh, you know, more the way you wanted uh, to hear or you wanted this person to make you feel. And I see a big heart here. So this is like a lot of pain and loss which you've been feeling after this person left. And I feel that something is supposed to, something is connected with spring. Or autumn you know these are the two weathers I'm getting so it's quite possible that this person passed away when it was spring or autumn last year you are never alone so there is something related to the lighthouse maybe you stay near a lighthouse or this person passed away near a lighthouse or he was or she was fond of watching lighthouse I see the reflection in this water so know that this person's reflection is like guidance for you. So next time when you see a lighthouse or light falling on the waters, you will always remember this person. Similarly, when you see falling leaves, whether it's a it's in a picture or you see it live, you know, happening in front of your eyes, know that these persons are trying to communicate with you. Again, this is a male face or you can see a godly presence here. So this person, these persons in both these cards have become your spirit guides. And uh, I hope this helps. For further detailed readings, you can always drop a message. I would more than happy, I would be more than happy to help you all. All my love to you. Thank you.